When we started talking about this movie in terms of a sense of adventure, an action sequence on a train was something we'd always wanted to do. We wanted to build upon the previous films and apply all of that knowledge to something practical and real and bring this train sequence to another level. There was not a surplus of trains available to be wrecked. We had to build the train if we wanted to destroy it. To shoot it practically was extremely challenging. Not just to execute, but also to design all the different train cars. And it could actually function on a working railroad track. No one else in the world is doing this level of practical filmmaking. And it may never be done again. The train sequence takes us on an adventure that's absolutely huge. We have this big fight on the roof, going 60 miles an hour through a real valley. I've done fight scenes, but to do them on a moving train is trial by fire. That's how Tom likes to do things. He's gonna now pull me off the train. When you're hanging off a train carriage, Tom's a great person to have beside you. Not only is he fearless, he is always looking to see how it's going to land for the audience. The crash in the train involved multiplying factors of difficulty. You'd be chasing the train as it goes off. Every single camera had exactly one shot at getting it right. It's not just a matter of going off. Because if we do it all, we don't capture it right. What's the point? Three, two, one. Action. Everything you are seeing in this spectacular train sequence is done to invest the audience in these characters. Hang on! Mission Impossible is the most extraordinary adventure franchise you've ever seen. You can only do it with a team like this and with an actor like Tom.